When a person is burned, when a when a person is when a person is burned, when a person is when a person is burned, when a per when a person when a person is burned extensively over their body, you will need to replace the fluids they have lost from insensible losses from the burn. At the same time, you don't want to drown these patients in IV fluids. This is where the Parkland formula comes in, which can help the healthcare provider calculate the IV fluid needs for the burned patient. This is the Parkland formula. It takes into account a person's weight, multiplied by the total body surface area burned as a percentage, multiplied by 4 cc's. This equation will give you the total amount of fluids to be given over the 24-hour period since the burn occurred. Half of this fluid will be given in the first 8 hours, and the other half will be given in the next 16 hours. So, for example, a 70 kilo male who sustains burns to the entire right arm, the chest and abdomen, has a total body surface area burned of 22.5%. Multiply this by his weight, and then again multiplied by 4, this will give you a total of 6.3 liters. This 6.3 liters is the total amount of IV fluids to be given over 24 hours, half of which is given in the first 8 hours, and the other half in the next 16 hours. So, half of 6.3 liters will give us 3.15 liters of IV fluids, which will be given in the first 8 hours. The rest of the 3.15 liters should be given over the next 16.